Your son wanted to have his 21st birthday party, Mr. Lilo. You told him, that's nice. Not in my house. Find a venue. Correct. You live in a house? Yes. But you said, not in my house. You can have your 25 friends someplace else. It's a condominium. I don't care what it is. He didn't want his 25 friends there. But found the defendant's house. So, Mr. Jang, is that the way you pronounce your last name? Yes, Your Honor. Now, you have a house that you must hate because you agreed to rent the house to Mr. Lilu's son, who was celebrating his... 21st. 21st birthday. Why you would do that, I don't know. In any event, what your claim is, sir, is that the house was so substandard for the party. Some things which actually Mr. Jang doesn't deny, that you want your money back. Well, the, the, it's a... Is that what your claim it's, is? It's, it's, I it's just want to know. A, it's a breach of contract. Is that what your claim is? Yes, I have to explain, though. Well, you don't have to explain. I read your complaint. They got there for the party, and you had problems with your plumbing. You want to describe the problems you had with your plumbing? Not uh, the problem that was incurred by Mr. Lulu. No, but I'm talking about before his party. I have had 12 parties with... Well, you told me, with 300 people and two bathrooms. Yeah. I don't know how you do a party with 300 people and two bathrooms, Mr. I... Jang. I don't know, unless you get porta potties now, if you hire porta potties, then you can have a party for 300 people. Because I read you have parties for 300 people, and for that, you have two bathrooms. Yes. And on the day of his son's birthday party, no matter what kind of slobs they were, am I correct, am I reading right, that you were telling the young women who were using the one working toilet that they couldn't flush paper down the toilet, that they should take the paper outside? In the covered trash bag, yes. That's ridiculous. Well, you have a hundred people who throw. Tra uh, I can't have that. People throwing he paper they down. They want hundred people. A, yeah. Well, no, 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 for no, all no, parties, no, no, no. that's the rule. Now, listen to me. That can't be the rule. You show me, and then I will dismiss the plaintiff's case. You show me in your contract where it says that people, when they use the bathroom, can't dispose of used toilet paper. This is going to be some case to air, by the way. You've got to play this one during sweeps. <laughs> in the toilet. Show me... Anywhere in your contract that it says that. I verbally told I don't you. care what you verbally said. Did you have a written contract? I have a written contract. I'd like yes. to see it. And I'd like to see in the written contract Show anywhere. Me Let me see the written contract. I want to see if you say we are supplying two bathrooms, but you cannot dispose of any waste paper in the bathrooms, in the toilet. I want to see where you say that. It's ridiculous. Well, here's the contract. Yeah, I'll show it this one. This is the same one. Right here. Bird, I'll take a look at both. Right here, right here. There. Okay. Here's the original one he signed and I signed. The, uh... Shh. Speak not. I don't see anything here about toilet paper. The paper on the toilet. The picture sign. of the toilet. It says a sign. No paper. In I see what it says on the sign. I'm looking at the contract. I don't care what the sign says. You rented a house, three-bedroom lodging, checkout time between 10 and 11 o'clock on April 17th, this party was for the 16th. How many working toilets did you have in this house? How many working toilets did you have? That would be one. For him, yes. That would be one for all the guests and the overnight lodging. And then this one toilet, you weren't allowed to flush paper. Is that what you're telling me? Yes, Your Honor. Now, I've got, I've got you had your party, right? Yes. How many people did you have? Uh, 22. Fine. Not 300 like you always have there. Anything else you want to tell me? <laughs> it all, it, quickly, I'll say how it began was when we first went and saw the place, he presented us with two toilets and an outside urinal pit that he wanted the men to use, which, of course, we refused. He showed us a women's bathroom, showed us the other bathroom, showed us the outdoor refrigerator that would be cleaned and working, ended up having one bathroom, no explanation of any other bathroom, the no refrigerator was not even plugged in, cleaned. He allowed us to put the cake in his personal refrigerator. How uh, does he have a personal refrigerator? Well, he lives in the house. The party was out in the backyard. It was not in the house. It was in the backyard, okay? I have a picture of kind of the just backyard. So you were just renting the backyard? Pretty much. 